Hello and welcome to Out of War. Today we're going to dig up the next coal layer. Let's just jump right into the time lapse. So first off I was removing the tiles to prepare for the digging. And then I wanted to prepare the area for that conveyor belt to go down. So the idea is to go like one layer down, I don't know, height of an excavator or a loader. And therefore I had to dig it all out as you can see here and I had quite some issues getting the conveyor belts aligned properly but I was able to figure it out. And then I started putting in some floor tiles to get better access to the area and then dig it out. And then I also used Draymite, the explosive, to completely clean out the area and make it easier to access the coal. As you can see here, I'm using the floor tiles a lot because it just makes it so much easier to drive around with the loader and I don't have to flatten the ground. If I drop a bit, it doesn't make a big difference. I also wanted to show you how it looks in real time when I'm digging up the coal vein here. In the latest update they actually changed the acceleration and I think they put another gear into the loader and potentially in other vehicles. And this thing is really really fast right now. Um, so you will see that probably in a, in a minute or so. When I'm backing up here, you see it on the bottom right, I'm in gear 4, in the rear gear 4, and I just lift it up, just going so fast. Um, in the past, like before that patch, a little trick where I went uh, forwards and backwards, and I just clicked up and down arrows to, to change uh, the gears back to the lowest and start again. But it, it has been slowed down here, so it doesn't really work anymore. And another thing I wanted to show here is how the the veins actually work in the game as you can see here the coal just goes straight down and i saw at a different youtuber's video that he, he did like dynamite he used the draymite and just dynamited its way down to see how long the vein goes and based on that it looks like those veins go super super deep if not to the absolute floor Okay, let me try and explain that a little bit better. So what you see here is the coal patch and the, the red areas, like basically the top piece of it. And then the coal itself actually extends down to like probably the very bottom of the map. And I try to highlight that in, in that green here. So you can see it just goes down. So however deep you dig, it will always be there. And that, that applies to all veins and ores that you can find in out of war as far as of today and the latest release this might change in the future so we'll see how that goes i'm going to show here yeah i put some draymite in there just to give you an idea and uh blowing it up right now just to show you that the vein is actually going further down right there yeah you can see it just goes straight down at that particular patch where it is so that's all coal what's coming up next, what I'm going to dig out here. And before I'm actually going to continue the digging, I want to put in another conveyor belt right here and extend it out just to make it easier to put the ore in and not only have to drive over there and drop it off. So I will show you now how I'm going to set it up. So first of all, I'm going to rip up the floor and then put some explosives down there, some Draymite just to get enough space for the hoppers to put them in. And then once it's all cleaned out, I'm gonna take the hoppers and then put them in there right away. But I had some issues here, as you can see. Um, with the alignment of these objects, so I put some some metal blocks in there just to make sure I can I can get a relatively easy setup and put in there. And this is how it looks in a time lapse. 
For the next minute and a half or so, you're going to see me digging out the entire coal layer here. So uh, relax and enjoy. Yeah, I think this vein is, at least at this particular level, it's basically dug out, uh, done. And there's like little tiny pieces here that if I drive in there, it might be tough to get, but basically this is it. Uh, let me see if I can grab one more here. Is there anything in there? Oh yeah, there's a bit. Okay, but that is about it. So my last delivery up here, we can check how much I delivered and how much it paid for in a second. Uh, let's ignore that piece. We can, we can go up here and have a look at it, how it looks. Yeah, pretty deep now. I don't want to fall down there. Might um, smooth out the edges like this. But yeah, we, we dug pretty deep. I think the whole thing goes down the entire way. As um, I might have said earlier. So let's check what we made today. I think we started down here. We started somewhere here. At the uh, 996. Yeah, yeah, that's today. That's when we started. Um, we made some, actually, yeah, here at 996. So I started, we had to pay the daily upkeep. Started at around a million and then uh, made some money. 139 tons, 30 tons, quite a bit. 124, 50 grand went up. Uh, I see daily upkeep to 955, 955,000 down. And then uh, all this stuff here, 180 uh, tons, 1.2 million, 1.25. And then the, uh, let's go up here. The last delivery, I think, went just in. So we are at 1.3 million. We started at a, at a million. We had like three three daily upkeeps um, and and loan payments, actually, three loan payments. And I still made a profit of 300,000. So that's pretty cool. The next thing I want to do, I want to move away from here. I think this just goes further down. What I'm looking forward to, um, somewhere there in the back, oops, there is a... Uh, you see that station is like a little gas station there, but behind that there's also a big ore. And I want to get in there, uh, dig around there, and I want to build a conveyor belt right over to here. So this will be super interesting. I might be able to reuse what I have already, but I'm not 100% sure on the alignment if I'm able to do that. So um, I think that is it for today. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching. Consider subscribing and 
Have a good day. Bye.